एट सो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट थर्टी एट बुक्स टूडे Hey you beautiful people welcome back to a new video on our channel Re Travel Become This particular video is one of the most requested videos If you have seen my vlogs during the last couple of weeks I did a lot of book shopping I bought books from Blossom Book House Bangalore I bought books from Mumbai the streets in front of the Flora Fountain and I'm very very excited to share all of these books with you guys I'll also show you the quality of these books how different was the quality of the books which I bought especially in Mumbai I'll also tell you if the books are original or not and why these books are cheap These are basically two sets of books but I also have a third set of books which is the most interesting set of books I have ever received in my life These books are the closest to my heart these books are amazing gorgeous they are just too good and i'm very very excited to share uh, these set of books with you from where did i get this third set of books for that you have to watch the whole video so make sure you watch the video till the end you may never know which thought or fact may resonate with you and change the course of your life so let's get started so let's quickly start with the books that i got from uh, blossom book house bangalore uh, i'll quickly show you just the books i i won't talk much about the books because i have a lot of books to cover This particular book I already showed you in my vlog, uh, *Sapiens: A Graphic History*. This is actually the original book written by Dr. Yuval Noah Harari, but in a graphic form. The illustrations are gorgeous. All of humanity's uh, experiences, all of humanity's ex explorations have been covered in this book in a very interesting way. Like this book is especially good for children because they would understand this particular easy language. They'll come to know how we got evolved, how humans got involved, how wars were fought, how our brain got evolved. This is written in a very 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 stylish way and i love these illustrations there are jokes throughout so it's a gorgeous book to have i i would definitely recommend everyone to have this particular book especially if you are a student and i was definitely fascinated by the quality of this book the next book which i got was uh, fight club this is the book on which the movie uh, fight club was based which was which was directed by david fincher and which is one of the most cult movies as we all know so i'm looking forward to reading this book next is uh, educated by tara westover i have heard a lot about this book i have actually read half of the book uh, some time back and i wanted a copy of my own i was actually reading one of my friends copies so i got this book the next is the illicit happiness of other people by manu joseph uh, manu joseph is the writer who wrote the book serious men so this is the same writer and this particular book is a very this is a very famous book of his and the story is uh, humorously dark it's a dark comedy next is uh, 40 rules of love by elif shafak i have read this book it was probably the first book which i completed uh, this year and it's a beautiful book it's a story of rumi and shams of tabriz this is a story of the bonding between these two characters so this is a beautiful book the cover also is dead gorgeous and uh, it's a long book actually but i i loved every bit of it and everybody should read this book it's a beautiful book next is uh, i got a copy of tools of titans by tim ferris uh, you might have heard of this book this book is a compilation of all the routines that successful people do the routines that successful people have uh, this is compiled by tim ferris like he has mentioned uh, all the celebrities in the index and whatever little routines they have it can be a morning routine it can be a success routine it can be a fitness routine he has compiled all of that into this uh, bible as he calls it i got this for pretty cheap and it's actually i don't think it's the original copy i don't know but uh, i think i got it for uh, 250 rupees but uh, it doesn't feel original but nonetheless i wanted this in my collection tools of titans is a very very uh, famous book uh, it's a famous compilation the next is uh, paulo coelho's brida i've heard good stuff about this book so i was looking forward to reading this book and the last from bangalore is the little book of yoga uh, which is basically the danish way of uh, living a healthy lifestyle so if you have heard of ikigai ikigai is basically a japanese technique uh, in which uh, there are certain principles that you need to follow to live, live a healthy life a happy life and this book is basically a danish way or to live a healthy and peaceful life this book is dead gorgeous it basically talks about uh, little things that uh, give you a feeling of uh, coziness a, a warmth it, be, it can be lighting it can be candles it can be you know visiting those cafes getting those little chunks of happiness in your daily routine it's a beautiful book the illustrations are beautiful there are some really really good pictures the quality of the book is amazing uh it talks about what food we should eat what kind of clothing we should wear you know what kind of uh, lighting arrangement should we have in our homes to have a cozy warm lifestyle uh danish people are said to be the happiest people on the planet consistently they also have uh, things like research institutes where they research about happiness they research about happiness index so this book talks about all of that so 
दिस इज द मुंबई वाला सेट दिस सेट आई गॉट फ्रॉम द प्लेस इन फ्रंट ऑफ फ्लोर ऑफ फाउंटेन द फर्स्ट इज स्टार वॉज द फोर्स अवेकेंस दिस इज एक्चुअली नॉवलाइजेशन ऑफ द मूवी Uh, I wanted to read this particular book because uh, I really like this movie, The Force Awakens. After Empire Strikes Back, definitely. But uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Next is uh, Ikigai. Uh, I didn't have a copy of my own. I actually read Ikigai in one of the libraries, so I wanted a copy of my own. I just got this particular book for ninety rupees. The quality is okay. Like if I show you the quality, uh, the print is okay, the font is okay. There are no distortions. It's just the front cover right it's it's it, it doesn't look original the original cover is way too pretty it's a, it's a hard cover this is a paperback otherwise i'm pretty happy like if in 90 100 rupees you're getting this kind of a book uh, this is a steel deal actually so yeah ikiga okay, is the one next is uh, think like a monk by jay shetty again this book is a, a first copy it is not a original copy but again the print is really really good again i got this for uh, 150 bucks only but the cover of the book doesn't feel original there is a slight hint of it being a pirated copy but at the same time if you look at the font if you look at the overall presentation of the book it's very neat next is sudha murthy's uh, something happened on the way to heaven again a sweet book i heard quite uh, i heard quite good things about this book Uh, one of my friends recommended it so i got this one the next is the rudest book ever by shwetab gangwar who is a youtuber now uh, you might be knowing him heard a lot about this book especially from youtubers and uh, i did read the book i finished the book in one day itself and uh, i i wasn't really impressed with the book per se because uh, some of the concepts were very very uh, repetitive to me i i don't think th- this was very original of him and uh, i thought somewhere down the line it was a kind of a marketing thing where you you actually talk what people like but uh, the book is good i am not saying it's not a good book uh, it, it is inspirational it will hit you where it needs to but uh, i didn't think it was very new based on how the hype was created around this book next is uh, malcolm gladwell's outliers uh, this is again an inspiring book it's a non fiction book uh, looking forward to reading this book this is also a pretty book it's gulzar's suspected poems poems written by gulzar uh i found this to be a very neat book and uh, little verses of poems by the very famous gulzar uh, looking forward to reading all these poems next is the nine chambered heart by janis periat in this story a girl is described by nine people around her uh, all these nine people have dif- different relationships with her and this is divided into nine chapters the next is life of pi you might have heard of it i finished reading this book also it's a beautiful book and uh, just like the movie the ending of the book was absolutely stunning the next is looking for alaska by john green uh, this is actually the debut novel of uh, john green who has also written fault in our stars so looking forward to reading this next is actually a collection of short stories this book is called uncommon type which is written by the legendary actor tom hanks uh, you might have uh, seen him playing the character of uh, forest gump I was totally intrigued I was totally interested to buy this book only by seeing this name Tom Hanks there's a typewriter which is common in all the stories the short stories are sweet warm and the next is the guide by RK Narayan uh, heard a lot about this book it's a classic book the next is India at 70 by Roshan Dalal so this book captures all of the events which happened after independence whatever major events have happened after our independence uh this is a structured way uh, written in this book it seemed nice the cover was really nice and the concept was also nice so looking forward to reading this and now comes the most interesting part of the collection of books which i have uh these are the most beautiful books uh, in my collection i'm going to show all of these to answer from where did i get these uh, i have actually got these from random thought bullets which is a youtube channel how did i get these is a mystery you have to wait for that uh, we did a small collab uh, i did a small collab with fellow booktubers with the channel random thought bullets you can check out the channel uh, i'll give the link in the description below we did a we did an extremely fun thing and uh, the video of which would be out on their channel in the first week of feb the video would be live the collab video uh, these books are a result of that collab video and uh, they were kind enough to Okay I want I want uh, I want spoil the surprise by telling you how did I get these books uh, and trust me when the video comes out you'll have a great time watching the video I love these guys they they make some amazing amazing content and uh, Tushar who runs the channel uh, is actually like a mentor to me also so do check out the channel I'll put the link in the description below 
The first is The Science of Interstellar written by the famous famous physicist Kip Thorn. This book is actually the back story of how the movie Interstellar was created. If you have been following me since quite some time, you know that I am a science fiction fan. I love space stuff uh, and Interstellar is by far my most favorite movie, the movie which is closest to my heart and to have this particular book is like a blessing. It's like a treasure in my collection. This this book has all the details which went into making the film uh, all the details of the images of the black hole the images of gargantua the time dilation stuff the singularity complex the event horizons everything is explained in this book the images are gorgeous the explanation is very very simple it's simple in such a way that even a layman can understand and uh, again hats off to mr christopher nolan and kip thorn for bringing such a mega concept to life uh, in the form of a movie so this book is very very special to me uh, next is a uh, percy jackson and the lightning thief this is the first part of the percy jackson series i wanted to know more about greek gods but uh, in a fun way so i got this next is moon walking with einstein so this book has a catchy name the title says the art and science of remembering everything so i'm guessing there are techniques in this book uh, by which we can memorize stuff so this is the one next is daring greatly by brain brown Uh, this is again a non fiction book it talks about vulnerability how the courage to be vulnerable transforms the way we live love parent and lead okay let's see how it is the next is flow by mihaly some russian name uh, i'm sorry i can't pronounce it the classic work on how to achieve happiness uh, i have been recommended this by a lot of people even by a lot of booktubers by a lot of friends so i'm really looking forward to reading this book i'll definitely give a detailed review make the video make a video for this particular book the next is the next is good to great by jim collins uh, this book is recommended by bill gates i first heard about this book bill gates recommending this book again a non fiction book the next is the ride of a lifetime by robert eiger you might have heard of this book is one of the most famous memoirs written by the ceo of walt disney which is one of the most successful companies in this in the world so really looking forward to reading uh, the life of disney and the life of robert eiger the next is plato and platypus walk into a bar i have talked about this book in my previous video it's a philosophy book it's a small book and uh, uh, it talks about philosophy through jokes in a humorous way uh, the writers have explained uh, the philosophy concepts next is how to live with statistics uh, the next is into the wild by john crocker uh, into the wild is uh, again was adapted into a movie and it remains one of the best travel books ever written i have recommended into thin air by john crocker i have read that book it was about an expedition to everest uh, which was a beautiful book and i am looking forward to reading into the wild also i have seen the movie i like the movie but as you all know books have a different uh, aura all together the next is dune by frank herbert uh, again a very very popular science fiction novel there is also a mo- again a movie coming up based on this particular book this this book was actually the bi- bible for all science fiction movies to come this book uh, dune uh, isaac asimov's foundation then hitchhiker's guide to the galaxy these books are all uh, my favorite kind of uh, genres which i like to read so that is why to capture that kind of an imagination is actually very very inspiring in the form of fiction so yeah the next is uh, again a non fiction book uh, factfulness by hans rosling this book was recommended by sir barack obama it's about the perspective of things uh, from what it's written here that it's written that uh, how people follow gen- how people generally follow what the notion of the world generally is uh, i'll definitely make make a video on this particular book as well because this is a very very important read this is a very important non fiction book which i have which i am yet to read so yeah The next is a uh, Cosmos by Carl Sagan. This book talks about uh, again this is a space book. It talks all about our universe, the observable and non-observable universe, how our universe came into existence and then there's the big bang theory, the, there's the the origin of life, the death of stars, the singularity events, the origin of matter. Everything is covered in this book. Uh, this book is a very very popular book and uh, this this again has been the basis of many tv shows as well like cosmos by carl sagan himself and cosmos by neil degrasse tyson so this book is actually the reference for all those uh, materials so that is why uh, i got this book and the last book of our haul is this gorgeous book 
a promised land by sir barack obama you might have heard of this book just look at the size of the book it gives me anxiety already uh, but yeah i mean i'm really looking forward to reading one of our one of our generation's most influential thinkers and uh, most influential leaders of our time i have read the book which he had written dreams for my father uh, this is going to be a very very long read and uh, i'm going to read it very very slowly taking my own time because it looks it give me anxiety <laughs> okay so that's all for this video guys i really hope you liked uh, all of these books these books are amazing you know making content out of these books also i want to you know express all the ideas written in these books uh, through my youtube channel as well so stay tuned to my channel and if you like my content don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the like button comment down below what your thoughts are and uh, share the video to someone who you feel would be benefited from watching this video thank you so much for all the support that you have given me we are soon going to hit uh, 10000 subscribers i am going to give i'm going to announce a mega mega giveaway as soon as we hit 10000 subscribers so make that happen guys uh, help me in that and uh, we'll have a great time together so thank you so much for all the support and uh, that's all for this video see you in the next video bye bye